Hi guys, Rachel here. So today I've got a different kind of video for you. I'm showing you how to um, print off a large photograph for your project life. <clears throat> so this is the first time I've done a screen, you know, recorded the screen, so bear with us. <clears throat> I recorded this and now I'm doing a voiceover on top of it, so... I may be going a little bit fast for years, but just there, I just went into my pictures and chose a picture and changed the ratio to square so I could print it off in 12 by 12. So there's, I'm just choosing the picture now in the Silhouette software and uh, I changed the size to 12 by 12 and I'm going to duplicate it 8 times because you'll see why in a moment. So I'm just making just a random square there and I go into the scale and change it to 4 by 6 and then I duplicate that another three times and then I duplicate it again but change the scale to 3 by 4 for the 3 by 4 and 3 by and 6 by 4 cards and then I just get one of the pictures and I move one of the 6 by 4 squares to the top right hand corner the left hand corner and I try and like size it up as good as I can and then I go to modify and I just click crop you've got to grab the two of them you'll see because I do it I do it a couple of times so you grab the oh god this is going fast <laughs> so you, you put it where you want it and then you double click and pull to go over the picture and the box and then you press crop and that it's done so yeah this page is for my um project life 2017 title page and yeah i just wanted something big scale and i kept it black and white because you know i like black and white <laughs> back on my pictures so here I was a bit confused because um because I did the top and the bottom first I wasn't sure where I was going to put the the four by three cards if I was going to have it in the right place so I just put the four by three cards at each corner and then I made another box that was 12 by four and I put it along the middle just to make sure it's even Yeah, I'm just evening it all up so I'm just to make sure that when I crop it I'm cropping the right places so I crop that so then I've only got that bit and then I duplicate it another three times thinking I would need to do it twice but I didn't I crop two bits at the same time this time so I cropped that bit and that bit I pulled in to highlight them all and cropped so then I've got that bit and again with the other side there and just measuring it up and then I pull to highlight them all and crop done so then I'm just jigsawing them back together just to see if it looks okay and if I did it all, if I did it right and I did so now I'm just taking everything back off and I'm going to change the size of my paper to A4 because I'm going to print it off on A4 paper this is me just trying to fit as many pieces as I can on at once and I wished I never now because you'll see why the uh, the the piece at the bottom didn't print off properly and I had to do it again. But yeah, so I print that off, and I'm just using my normal print out to print off these. Um, I'm not bothered about it being um, on. You know photo paper i could have used photo paper but my printer doesn't uh print off on photo paper very very nice i've tried it and it just doesn't look nice i might have to upgrade my printer but anyway there i am back go back on so i deleted them other parts moved some more parts over and then i'm printing that off
There's my second page. And then I'm back over here, putting all the rest of the pieces in, printing it off. And it was quick and as easy as that. I just thought I'd show you guys how I did it and I wanted to try out how to you how to do the record the screen of my laptop so this is like a test uh, video so here I am back at my table and I cut the pieces out to size using my paper trimmer and uh, while I'm doing it I'm also like measuring the measuring the sizes of the photos just to make sure that they printed off properly and most of them did apart from that last piece that uh, that I was telling you about before so I'm just gonna leave you now with a little bit of music to watch the process of us uh, putting the page together I don't really do much I had a few um, a few embellishment stickers and the 2017 and I call it finished so thank you so much for watching Um, I hope this video was okay for you it was just a tester like I said and yeah see you in the next video bye guys bye